Hello, just finished my uh, reloading bench here a couple days ago. So just kind of getting things set up and I thought I might just as well pop a quick little video on this. Um, used 2x8s, 2x10s. I kind of like to overbuild things quite a bit. That way, as I'm cranking on stuff, I don't have to worry about it. Kind of making life good. I've got the Dillon 550 as my mainstay as far as my uh, reloader. I'm doing a couple project ones, but um, it's just kind of, I really like the wood, how things turned out on it. You can kind of see some of these I need to do some more fixing up and getting stuff a little better organized but I thought this would be a good at least get a starter video on it um, we'll paint board up on that kind of change this whole area out actually I've got my rack above it there with a few rifles and then this is just kind of going to be my corner here should get me quite a bit of the torque on anyway uh, I don't think there's any way I think I could jump up and down on that thing and wouldn't budge it at all and that was kind of what I designed it for that way I wouldn't have to have any legs out there uh, can go ahead and wheel right up. I'm going to try and put some shelves and probably some drawers underneath there too. But I've got it tied in with the studs. And then they come all the way out here. Whoops, I guess some of this is kind of tough to see. I have to do this in broad daylight. It's nighttime now, and with my lights in here, it's really not looking the best. So, no, this is just a quick overview on reloading bench and probably gunsmithing bench a little bit. I've got my other one over here, but it's not. Not near as stout. It's just over here and it's it's quite a mess, so so I need to recalibrate and get everything brought over. And uh that's kinda kinda the reloading room and the gun room and everything up here. So just to get a quick first video on on this stuff. Now that I finally got some uh, supplies of powder back in, so I replenished a bunch of powder. Um, got a bunch of bullets replenished. Uh, and I've got my old stock on primers, but as soon as I can get a new stock on primers, then I want to start cranking stuff up. But I don't want to, I, I like to keep a good supply just uh, for reserve. So, hope you enjoy the bench and like I said it's definitely a, a stout bugger I don't think like I said I don't think there's any any way I'm gonna out crank on this thing <laughs> 